Mario, let's try this again. Hello, everybody. Welcome. I suppose welcome back is in order to Ghost of Tsushima. Um, if you remember back during the pandemic, I'd started a blind playthrough of this, and it was definitely something I enjoyed, and then I kind of ruined it by being on a party chat. Um with some friends and they were talking about a really stupid video by a really stupid guy so and it just kind of pissed me off because i didn't like the video i watched it i thought it was pompous and personally thought that it wasn't very well put together so but it just it honestly just kind of like I, I ruined the experience for myself as much as they did so it's ultimately just kind of became a situation of well you know that shit happens, or that shit happens sometimes. So I ended up just abandoning the blind playthrough so I could enjoy the game on my own. Um, but yeah, I figured since Assassin's Creed Shadows is coming back, or is coming in November, that it'd be cool to do a samurai game. And it was either going to be this, um, like a Dragonetian, or Fate Samurai Remnant. And I let the people on the interwebs who follow me who are actually interested in watching my stuff um i let them pick and ultimately uh only people on tiktok uh responded <laughs> which is funny because the tiktok video is the one taking the longest okay there it is now it's kind of like the tiktok update and notification that the stream is happening now uh is taking the longest to upload but It ultimately it was, it was kind of a funny situation. Um, so, yeah, we are... So basically, the only people on TikTok really picked, and the general consensus was Ghost of Tsushima. So I figured we'd do this, and like I said, the previous one I'm going to do, an, or the announcement, I'll probably also do an Assassin's Creed to go along with it, depending on how far we go. I'm going to do this on medium, just because I feel like it would be more interesting to have a challenge. But it's also been very long since I played this game, so I feel like hard is going to be too much. So we're going to do it on medium. And ultimately, um, I think we're going to do... We're going to do it with the English audio, just because. Um, and... Yeah. So. <clears throat> oh, the, the other thing. Um, if we have enough... To, or if both this and the Assassin's Creed game end up not leading directly into Shadows, I'll probably start um, one of the other games. It'll probably be like a situation of, and let me know if you actually would prefer this to what I'm thinking initially. Let me know if you would prefer like me jumping into the next Samurai game. So like after Ghosts of Tsushima and the Iki Island expansion, um, if you would want me to go straight into, like, Fate Samurai Remnant, and then, uh, like, a Dragon Dragonetian, because I honestly think it would be kind of fun to have, like, a lot of different, like, Samurai games that are, like, different periods of Japanese history. Um, but anyway. Playing it on PS5, so I get all the juicy, happy feedback, and get all the, uh, oh shit, I have no idea if this is 60 FPS. The Mongol Empire is invading our home. They are brutal. Relentless. Thousands of them. We will face death and defend our home. I just realized Tradition. Was the same color scheme. Courage. As, um, Honor. As they are what make us. 
We are warriors of Tsushima. We are samurai! Nobodachi, go break their spirits. Heads up to the people who started watching first up high. Second off, I'm gonna peak the audio in a little bit, probably. So just maybe turn down the uh, uh, audio super quick, because I don't want to accidentally hurt your ears. I'm also gonna move the microphone away from my mouth. So that way it's not super bad. I might also put my hand. Outsiders! Send your finest warrior to face me! Nada, Jinnida. Adachi's got balls, by the way. I always as sucky as this kind of ends up being for him. Adachi's got balls. I am Haru Nobu Adachi, descendant of the legendary Yoshi Nobu Adachi. I felt like having my own little battle fly there. Horsey, no! As a command, Lord Shimura. Lord Shimura coming in clutch. Men, we must hunt down the Mongol leader. Everyone, with me. No Mongol dog. Hunt them down. Left. There is only one path. Find the Mongol leader and end him here. I'll fight beside you to the end. I know.
Damn, his armor got trashed by that explosion. Oh, I just realized there's an arrow in his back. Oh, and there's another! Grandson of Genghis. Brother, you are a warrior. I can see that. You trained your whole life for this. And you have won battles that lesser men have called unwinnable, yes? But while you were sharpening your sword, do you know how I prepared for today? I learned. I know your language, your traditions, your beliefs, which villages to tame and which to burn. So I'll ask you once again, Samurai, do you surrender? Like, let's be honest, that man should not be alive. <laughs> While we have a second, I just kind of want to take a look at the, uh... How did I get here? Mongols. Someone saved me. Hit me back here. Maybe they have my sword. Found it. Broken. But better than nothing. Someone was sharpening their blade. A warrior.
all your wounds. Can you run? I... I think so. Where's my sword? Not here. You're on! Here! I'll take care of this. Please, hide. Oh, oh don't hurt me! Shield, Lumini! Rice! You want your sword? Follow me. How long was I out? Long enough for the Mongols to conquer half the island. No. Shh. Not now. Shit. Get down. <sighs> Let's move. This way. Nothing we can do for her. But I can save the others. Lord Shimura was with me on the battlefield. Jito, forget him. Yuna, wait. Lord Shimura is my uncle. You're Jin Sakai? The Jito's nephew? I have to know. Did he survive? I think so. The Mongols took him prisoner. Where did they take him? East, along the coast. Toward Castle Canada. They must be holding him inside, celebrating their victory. I could take them by surprise. You'll be killed. Or oh, I'll rescue Lord Shimura. And help him drive the Mongols into the sea. He can contact the Shogun, call for reinforcements. I didn't nurse you back to health to watch you throw your life away. Why did you save me? I couldn't leave you to die. I need your help. Lord Shimura can help our whole island. And he's the only family I have left. Let's move. So stealth in this part is actually relatively easy if you can't tell, which is nice because it's the game basically saying this is how you sneak around. Shit. We cleared the road. If we cross, someone's bound to see us. I'll take that chance. Wait. God. Fields, you're a thief. When I need something, I take it. Like my katana? I traded it for food and medicine. You what? Don't worry. We'll find the buyer. Get your sword back. 
You've got a long ride ahead. Take whatever supplies you can carry. This is someone's house. And they're not coming back. So supplies are actually the currency of the game. Um, you can't tell. Uh, again, you probably can, I don't know, but... I feel like the HDR is also really fucked. Could just be the darkness. I apologize for fucking around with everything while I'm also playing. I traded your sword to lives just up ahead. Toro! Shit, the bastards found him. Stand watch. I'll search the house. He will answer for this. He must be here. It's actually a really nice sword. I am Jin Sakai, nephew to the great Lord Shimura. And I am no coward! <laughs> Your enemy is no match for you. But you still lack control. I was practicing. With your father's weapon? The sword of Clan Sakai has saved lives and ended wars. Who did this to you? No one. I will teach you to defend yourself. I know how to fight. Master your blade, you must first control your emotions. I can do that, Uncle. Show me. Let's see what you've been practicing. Try to strike me. Yes, Uncle. Attack! I am ready. Try to strike me. I was hoping for a ring out. Well done. If you'd fought like that, your attacker would not have bruised you so easily. It wasn't a fair fight. Imagine he's returned to finish what he started. And he'll use every dirty trick he knows. How will you defend yourself? He's big, but I'm quicker. I'll stay out of his reach. Wait for him to get tired. Then drop him with one strike. Good. A samurai must always fight with patience and discipline. Even when his opponent resorts to trickery. I'll remember, uncle. Now, break through my defenses. Show me Jin Sakai is a warrior of great courage. Bring my block with a heavy attack, then strike quickly. A heavy attack will unbalance your foe. Follow with a quick strike. Attack later. Fine block. Good. I'm sore.
Can we take a break? We're not finished yet. Find your resolve and fight through the pain. Good. This is your health. This is your resolve meter. Draw on your resolve to heal and perform other special abilities. Gain resolve by killing enemies, parrying attacks, or using other advanced skills. It's time you learn to parry. Wait for me to make the first move. Once I strike, block my attack. You must parry before I strike. Fine parry. Good form, Jin. You're improving. Need to catch your breath? <laughs> it will take more than a child to knock the wind out of me. Now then, let's see you defend against a spear. Dodge my spear, then follow up with a counterattack. Good reflexes. When I thrust, you dodge. Excellent counter. Excellent dodge. Remember, dodge, then counterattack. You have a small opportunity to strike. Use it. You see, there is no weapon, no warrior you cannot overcome. Thank you for these lessons, Uncle. We are not finished yet. Jin Sakai, will you honor me with a sparring match? I wouldn't want to hurt you. If you're that confident, let's make this interesting. <laughs> the first to land five strikes gets to choose dinner. I hope you like octopus. <laughs> Very good, Jin. Before we eat, I have one last question. For generations, our families have lived by a code. Tell me the virtues that guide us. Loyalty to our Lord, control over our emotions, and... You know this. Honor. To fight bravely and uphold the legacy of Clan Sakai. Those are your father's words. What does honor mean to you? I guess... Protecting people. The ones who can't fight for themselves. You have a good heart. But first... We must show everyone that we serve our lord with courage. Integrity and self-control. You say that like it's easy. It's never easy, Jin. I struggle with it every day. But we must set an example for our people by remaining true to our code and to ourselves. That is the meaning of honor. Ah, not her samurai! Sword. Where can I find a horse? The stables aren't far. This way. Hmm. Just blood on my sword. I need to clean it. <laughs> More riders. Islands crawling with them. Where are the stables? Behind that burning farmhouse. Follow me. We can get close, slit their throats, and kill them without a sound. Without honor. I will not break my code. Face me, invader! 
So one of the things that the game really... It's close. We can't save everyone. I'm done running, and I can finally help. Damn it. Hold on. More guards. Don't let anyone escape. Thank you, my lord. They said all the samurai were dead. Do you have somewhere to hide? I heard Golden Temple might be safe. Go. Stay off the roads. And guard your son with your life. You risked your life for them. They couldn't defend themselves. And I... I can't let more of our people die. They're not the only ones who need you. My brother. The Mongols took him. That's why you saved me. Taka is my only family. And Lord Shimura is mine. Please. I just want my brother back. I'll help you find him after I save my uncle. I promise. I'm coming with you. Stables are just up ahead. So one of the things the game really focuses on, if you can't tell, is the direction of attack. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck! I said I wanted a challenge. I'll just bet it's pretty tough. Let's get to the horses. How do I do the uh focus hearing press swipe guiding wind and gestures? They're samurai horses. A few we didn't take into battle. Lucky for them. And us. Which horse do you want? Okay, so I've actually got a couple different horses. Uh, these three here are the ones you get automatically, no matter what version of the game you bet. If you get the digital deluxe edition, you get this special horse. Easy there. He suits you. And he needs a name. <laughs> Kage, born from the darkness. Kage! We traveled from Komoda. East, along the roads, all the way, across a river, to Castle Canada. Castle Canada. They're holding your uncle inside. The walls are too high to climb. We could cause a distraction. Sneak in. No. We walk in the front gate. Kotun Khan set fire to our best swordsmen. Humiliated my uncle. Butchered the warriors of Tsushima. I'm going to repay his kindness. By repeating the same mistakes that got your friends killed. That's what the Mongols will think. But this time, I'll strike first. Wait here until I finish them. Alright, this is the function of the standoff. So... As I was saying before I was brutally murdered by a Mongol, um, the direction of the attack is probably the most important thing aside from like the parrying and everything because you don't automatically parry an enemy if you manage to hit the button correctly. If you're 
if an enemy attacks you from behind, you will receive damage from behind. So, and even attacking, you're going to attack the direction you're facing. So, that's one of the things that definitely... Swordsmanship in this game is a lot more complex than other samurai games. But it's also very rewarding. And this is standoffs. Basically, when you approach an enemy encampment, or when you approach enemies, you challenge them to a standoff. And basically, it's a contextual thing. Hold Y and then release it once they attack to kill them in one go. Oh. I've come for Lord Shimura. Captain Salak that way. Successfully doing this will actually fill your um, resolve here really quickly. There is no medicine in this game. You are going to be incredibly dependent on your resolve. You did it. Don't sound surprised. What's all that noise? Not sure. The Mongols fired them off at the beach. Oh, she's using a bow and arrow. Hmm, weird prison box. I'm just ready. Keep moving. We can't retreat. Uh, yes, you can. Keep going. I have to fall back. Alone? Keep the path clear. When I find Lord Shimura, we'll need a quick escape. I'll get the horses ready. Do it. If I'm not back soon, ride for the forest. Okay, thank you. their attacks let their uh, opponents know get the fuck or enemies know get the fuck out of the way you need to watch for that because that'll be your warning also to get the fuck out of the way uh, there are no supplies oh fuck yay I ended his suffering Boo! I shouldn't have done that. I'm right here. 
I love all the come at me bro energy that is being displayed. It's just ridiculous. But also watch as I basically kill that guy in one go. His honor. <laughs> Jin, your uncle has told me much about you, Jin Sakai. I will show him his nephew, broken and humiliated, begging to join the Mongol Empire. Jin. This is your time, Lord Sakai. From here, little bird. Your uncle is watching. Submit, Yosakai. I'll slit your throat. Yeah, you're not expected to win the fight. Show your uncle how easily he can bring peace to your home. Save yourself. Young master, it's time. I'm coming, Yuriko. The whole island has come to mourn your father. Can't you send them away? You must face them, Jin. You are now the master of Clan Sakai. Yes. You're not alone, Jin. Your father is the wind at your back. Your mother, the birds in the trees. And uncle? 
Yugi will tell you. At your father's pyre. Thank you, Yuriko. If you ever need guidance, Clan Adachi will help you. Father protected the people above all else. A true samurai. Oh, there he is, Lord Ishikawa. I was like, wait a second, where the fuck? I thought that was Uncle. There's Uncle. That makes more sense. Save him. I was a coward. Jin, you are a samurai. He died because of me. Your father fell in battle saving his only son. His reward is a warrior's death. Now you will carry on his legacy. Your father's spirit resides within this blade. He is always with you. to my fortress as my ward. Today, say goodbye to your father. So the Iki Island expansion expands on this a lot more. But for now, Jin has, feels like he's failed for the second time protecting his family, and he's got to pick himself back up. Father. How do I save him? So, the whole thing about um, uh, Jin's father, I believe his name is Kazuma, being at his back, isn't just like a, you know, he was o he's always going to be with you thing. It's also a game, um, uh, mechanic, basically, instead of having just like an audible checkpoint thing. Um, you know, you know. The wind basically guides you to your next destination. Jin, what happened? I found Lord Shimra. I could have saved him, but the Khan was there. I failed my uncle. At least you're in one piece. I swore to protect this island with my life. But now the Mongols have stolen our home, killed our samurai. You forgot what it's like to fight someone stronger than you. To feel weak. 
sometimes when you're staring death in the face. You have to do whatever it takes to survive. The Khan expects to fight a war against the Samurai. He will anticipate our every move. Unless we find new ways to surprise him. Hide! In the grass! They must be searching for you. Bastards scared off the horses. They're samurai mounts, trained to return to their masters. Nice trick. The Mongols must be hunting you. We should split up. I'll draw their attention while you escape. I'm not leaving your side until we've saved my brother. First, I need to find more allies. Trained warriors. Like Sensei Ishikawa and Lady Masakuadachi. They can help. My brother can help too. Once we save him, you'll have the island's best blacksmith in your debt. He'll make whatever tool you need to save your uncle. Something to scale the castle walls? You dream it, Taka can make it. Where are they holding him? He was captured near Kechi. Ride there and ask around. I'll join you soon. Taka won't last long in the Mongol cage. Mina, we will save your brother. And your uncle. Plus picks up right here. The game Ubisoft is should have made years ago. Ghost of Tsushima. Seriously, that's that is the consensus by everyone who's played this. Game. Act one, we rescue Lord Shimura. All right. So, like I said, the wind um, acts as. Here's the map, so I will God, there's a lot of information we have to cover here. Okay, so all right. So the basically the game heavily encourages you to explore the island of Tsushima, which is a beautiful island. You absolutely should explore it. Um, but from there, the game is also has the main functions, which are the main story stuff, which is tales. Um, tales can kind of last quite a while depending on the particular tale, but they'll all generally are focused on progressing the story or progressing like your bonds with allies. Um, so we've got two tales right now. Uh, you see, there are nine of the Ishikawa tales. This is the main story. But ultimately, and everything gets you sort of specific um, reward, especially early on, you're going to get a lot of mechanics for the game, 
So, doing the Warrior's Code, uh, aside from a major legend increase, which is your level in the game, you'll also get the focused hearing ability and the main ability of assassination. Um, and then if you do sen uh, and sen with Sensei Ishikawa, you gain um, the archery skill and a half bow, which is the... We're going to do that first. <clears throat> we're actually... That's the first thing... Probably the last thing we're going to do in this stream since it's been almost an hour. So... We are going to do Sensei Ishikawa's story first. Uh, and then... Oh, should not have jumped off the horse. We will go do the main story because ultimately... The beginning part of the game... Is basically focused... Mechanically on getting you... Much like all good video games. Um, mechanically, it's focused on getting you accustomed with everything that the game is trying to do. Um, in terms of the story, part one and a lot of the early game is basically focused on. Uh, oh, and just run along and grab materials. You're going to need them. Um, is focused on building up your allies. You are. A broken man with nothing. You have damaged armor and no allies to aid you. However, there are still people on Tsushima who can help you. So, ultimately, that's what a lot of the beginning of the game is. You have to find Sensei Ishikawa, Lady Masako, Ta uh, Taka, Yuna's brother. You have to find all these people uh, there we go. Um, and they are going to help you um, attack Castle Canada and free Lord Ishimura. With him, um, you'll have more backing, and then you'll be able to take the fight to the Mongols. If you've played this game, you already know all this, but I still want to say it because it's fun. And it's good to kind of just refocus and remember all this uh, stuff. Anyway, oh. there is a fast travel in this game, but in all honesty, this game very much encourages you to just travel by horse or by foot. supplies yeah like I said supplies are the currency for the game um, yep so this is you can equip charms to augment your abilities yes I know but I don't think I have any charms oh I have this okay I also have some of the DLC stuff uh... I kind of want to, you know what? Let's leave that alone for now. Right, so, okay. You know what? We will leave the armor alone for the most part. But we are going to switch this back. No, no, let's switch it over now. This is basically all the, um... Equipment that you get from the, uh... Deluxe Edition, if you purchase it. So at the very least, it is helpful early on. Because you'll get a pretty good set of armor and some stuff that helps. Also, this just is honestly a really good looking one, too. Alright, let's 
Have Kage stuck up here. Yoshi Springs. Perhaps someone at the inn can direct me to Sensei Ishikawa. also is a gesture that allows you to sheath and unsheath your sword. And when you're removing blood from it, uh, it has a lot of different animations for that, which is really cool. Do you need anything, my Guess what I was wrong. There are several different currencies in the game. Like to see what I have? So this merchant is a cosmetic you survived the invasion? So far. Have we met before? Uh, no, my lord. But I watched you ride into battle. Please accept this gift. If you wear it, they say a spirit will lead you to whatever you're looking for. Sounds like something you could use yourself. Not with Mongols prowling the countryside. But if it leads you to any flowers, bring them to me. Or other traders. We can use them to fashion dyes. I'll remember that. Thank you. If you can bring more, it's yours. So yeah, basically, the customization in this game is really good. You can customize your sword, and I want to say it's not a wakazashi. A wakazashi, because I, I have a wakazashi. Wakazashi is like a shorter um, melee weapon. Um... Okay, so it is Wakazashi. So then what do I have? It might be a Wakazashi? I don't know. I'll have to, I'll have to look into that. But uh, So essentially, you have two weapons, and all weapons, are, or all weapon skins more, are yours. equipped as a set. So you can't have the Prowling Tiger sword set with the Snow Demon's Eyes. Uh, I wish you could, though. Then you also have different dyes for your armor, which, actually, I'll probably equip the Traveler's Attire. And then you have hats. Okay, so basically you can track flowers, and every outfit has, like, a different thing for it. Um, you can track artifacts with guiding wind. Basically, these are flowers and anything else. You're going to find yourself switching between armor a lot. I'm just going to be entirely honest there. Oh well. Some armors are better for others than others in terms of what you're trying to do. But not every armor is going to be applicable in every situation. So just keep that in mind. Lord, you must be weary from battle. Come, soak in the healing waters of these hot springs. Replenish your strength for the challenges to come. I must be at my best for all of them. Then follow me, my lord. Oh, okay, so 
There are a lot of different collectibles in the game, but each has kind of a specific purpose. Living in the hot springs restores your spirit, and if you make a habit of it, the waters will grant you a long and prosperous life. Enter here. The waters are warm and calm. Basically, if you rest at a hot spring, you will restore your health. And you'll also gain a health upgrade or components to a half upgrade. I'll never forget the day he was killed. I could have saved my father. If only I was older, stronger. If I wasn't so afraid. Every hot, sp every new hot spring you visit basically etches out a little extra help. Such an improvement. Surely you will triumph over our enemies. I feel ready to take on the whole Mongol army. Thank you. It was my pleasure. There are hot springs all over the island. Make use of them. Take time to heal and reflect. The practice will keep your body ready for battle, my lord. You are going to want to visit as many hot springs as possible because it's the only way to increase your health. And it's also an easy way, or a free easy way to increase your, um, or to heal yourself instead of having to use a resolve always. Another samurai? Alive? I thought Lord Jin Roku was the only one. I don't know the name. He's in Kashinim, my lord. I'm sure he would be happy to see you. I'm curious to meet him. There are also various rumored locations and various um, tales or various side missions, tales of Tsushima. For example, we have one where basically um, this one is basically there's another samurai. But for now, we're going to do the tale of Lord Ishimura. Ishikawa. I'm looking for Sensei Ishikawa. I thought he fell at Komoda. He didn't. Where is his dojo? To the forest. I can show you the way, my lord. Thank you. As good as dead. Did the Sensei not fight at Komoda? No. He came to town for supplies the day before the invasion. Hardly spoke a word, but he's always been a private man. My lord, are the stories of Sensei Ishikawa true? What stories? They say he sank a pirate ship with a single arrow. <laughs> Not the ship, but he shot a pirate captain from the shore, routed the whole fleet. I'd hate to cross an archer like that. Do you deserve death? I hope not, my lord. Then you're safe from Ishikawa. <laughs> The Sensei's dojo is up there on the cliff. Komoda burned. But Mogri fell. Nowhere is safe. Thank you. I'll take it from here. One more question, my lord. May I ask why the Sensei left his post as archery master to Clan Nagao? No one knows. Strange. Giving up service to a great lord for this. So I forgot that with the outfits, or that the outfit thing basically changed um, with an update. Basically, each outfit now grants like a specific amount or like specific 
um, equips. There's like specific sets. So wearing the broken armor will always equip the white headband and the clan of Sakai um, gear for the uh, sword. But the hero of Sushima armor, because I set it up this particular way, will always equip the mask, the helmet, and all the other components of the Hero Tsushima outfit. So the Traveler's attire, will always, unless I change it, will always have this purple headband, and I can even add a mask, and that would come off other ways. So, okay, it's a nice little reminder. As to some of the changes that were made post-update, or post the updates. So that is how the game will always function now. So I would say if you want to be as loosey-goosey with uh, armor choices as possible, um, birds will also lead you to the stuff, but we'll, deal with, we'll discuss that when it becomes relevant. Um, for now, like I said, uh, we've been streaming for a while, so I let's do the mission with Sensei Ishikawa. Get our half bow and then move along. Move along. Like I know you should. Since this goes dojo. There was a struggle here. Better look around. Dried blood. The fight wasn't recent. Someone was wounded. Remove the arrow. Which is always a bad idea. Never pull an arrow out. Bloody footprints. Because it, the their arrows are designed. Him. Maybe the sensei is in his house. To basically take as much flesh with you as possible. As gross as that is, it's true. Oh, it's true. Boop a beep a bop a boop boop burp. Zip a burp a Yep a little down below. Humble home for a samurai. I'm taking your flowers. Don't move. Don't shoot! Sensei Ishikawa. Lord Sakai's boy. You survived Komoda. We could have used your bone. I was on my way when bandits attacked me. Are you expecting them to return? A samurai is never caught by surprise. I'm sorry about Lord Shimura. He was a good man. He's alive. Taken captive by the Mongols. Then there's hope. That's why I've come. Help me save him. I can't. My student is missing. A skilled archer. I will help you look. Then you can both help me free Lord Shimura. Try and keep up, Sakai. The Tale of Sensei Ishikawa. made it out of Kumuda. No one knows. Are there any others who can fight back? Besides us? I don't know yet. You better find out quickly. We can't free your uncle by ourselves. I can help track your student. I need no help tracking Tomoe. Tomoe? A woman? From what clan? No clan. A peasant. But she can outshoot any samurai I know. Even you, Sakai. The last time I saw you was ten years ago. You came to study with me. You remember? I remember most of the students I reject. Instead, you took this Tomoe as your student. You showed promise. Tomoe is a prodigy. Mongols, take them. Let's 
I have to think that's the dodge button. Damn. Fight like drunk Tanuki. They fought well enough at Komoda. You and Tanuki go. can catch a tiger when it's sleeping. That idea also amuses me. Drunk Tanuki. The moist trail picks up here. Come! Which I suppose... The Tanuki... Mongols took Fort Nakayama. That patrol likely came from there. That's close to the hot springs. The town will be the next to fall. Something happened here. An ambush. Look around. Blood. But not much. No one died. A Japanese quiver. A gift to my greatest student. Rice and millet. Left uneaten. The attack was sudden. I fear the worst. The Moy would never leave the quiver behind. Unless she was pursued. Or captured. To what end? Interrogation. Torture. Worse. They may be doing the same to Lord Shimura. Fear is a weapon, Sakai. Do not let the Mongols use it against you. Your student. Where would they take her? Fort Nakayama. The fort is nearby. I should have fought the Komoda with you. Better you didn't. We lost enough there. Why did the samurai fail? The Mongols fought like animals. Wrong answer. I saw it with my own eyes. An archer's aim relies not on eyes, but on body, mind, and spirit. Stop here. We need to talk. What's wrong, Sensei? This bow was a gift to me from Lord Nagao many years ago. It's a beautiful weapon. Of course it is. And there's nothing more painful to me than a perfect bow ineptly used. Then it's a good thing you're giving it to me. <sighs> Who said anything about giving? Prove you can shoot straight. I'll let you borrow it. <laughs> Try it out before we go into battle. Aim for that lamp closest to us. Now the one further down the road, on the left. Not bad. Let's see if you can hit the one furthest away. The further the target, the more your arrow drops. Focus, Sakai! I'm getting used to the grip. How does it feel? Like it was made for me. It wasn't. So take good care of it. Let's go. A bow like this would have helped at Komoda. It is a good bow, but victory is won by warriors, not weapons. You haven't seen the Mongols fire weapons. They have not yet won. Fort Nakayama. I hope your student is inside. We'll get a better look at the defenses from up there. Perfect. I'll find a way in. Open the gate. Then we hit them. You always charge into battle with your Hakama half tied? You have a better idea? Patience, Sakai. The Mongols will send men to find their missing patrol. When they open the gates, we strike. The longer we delay, the longer Tomoe remains in danger. She can take care of herself. Survey the battlefield. 
What can we use to our advantage? Hornet nests. One shot could stir them up. Mm, the Mongols will face the sting of insects and arrows. Those barrels could do some damage. We'll find out. An arrow in those hanging lights will kick up sparks. <laughs> and start fires. They have many archers. They're skilled, but we are better. When the gates open, distract the enemy and rain arrows on their heads. Then we storm the fort and free Tomoe. Good. Now we wait. They're opening the gates. Wait for my signal. Inside. Not for long. Let's find Tomoe. If you want supplies, take them. Cause the dead don't have supplies to you. Oh, that was stupid of me. Stop it! Thank you, Master. Yeah, if we're jumping straight in the battle, I'm gonna mad as well. Switch over to the hero of Sushima Armor. Oh yeah, so 
we'll get into that when we officially unlock the water stance. So basically, you have to kill these guys in order to unlock new stance. Stance is by different uh, opponents. Uh, advantages and disadvantages in combat. And the idea is also you're going to want to them in combat in order to properly you know, win battles. Uh, Slain prisoners. Tied up. Killed with arrows. Tomoe isn't. Wait, this pendant belongs to her. Search the fort! Someone's personal quarters. A woman's kimono. Tomoe's kimono. The Mongols freed her. Why? arrows are Japanese. They're Tomoe's arrows. You are sure? I taught her to make the knock with deer horn. And that curve of the evil feathers. So the Mongols took her weapons? The shots are tightly clustered. No Mongol shoots Japanese arrows with such skill. Huh. Then they allowed her to use a bow. terms with Mongolian translations. Your name is mentioned. She was teaching them my way of the bow. Yeah, that's... Do you hear that? A survivor. with us but they set her free gave her armor and a bow she killed my wife and the others the bodies we found she proved her skill to the enemy and they recruited her please it it hurts don't leave I've seen enough. Let's go. And she killed her. Sensei? The boy won her freedom. And she joined the Mongols. Why would she do that? What happened? I pushed her too hard. Pushed her how? What are you hiding? Sensei! I demand an answer. She attacked me. Not bandits. Tomoe. Why? She has no idea what it means to be samurai. You drove her to the Mongols. Do not judge me. Do not lie to me. I can't let Tomoe teach my way of the bow to the enemy. And we will stop her. This is my fight. I don't need your weapon. No, you need me. Victory is won by...
And when the time comes, you will. I can't rescue my uncle alone. I need more people to join our fight. Fine lady, Masako Wadachi. Hi, horsey. They completed the first tale of Sensei Ishikawa. He's now an ally, and I now have a bow! And I earned a technique point. Bought one of these. Yeah, well. But yeah, these are the other stances. You have to defeat Mongol leaders in order to unlock them. But basically, different stances are more effective against certain enemies. Uh, the stone stance we have right now is the most effective against um, the swordsman. The water stance against shieldmen. Wind stance is effective against spearmen. And the moon stance is effective against brutes. And then these is uh, ghost abilities. You unlock these through story and then also um, building your legend. So. That's basically everything there. Oh, yeah. Um. Oh, show mask and cutscenes. Uh, that's how I screwed up. Oh. Now I can unlock the. Now I can do the tale of Lady Masako. But we will do that next time!